Hey guys, Mike Grady here. Just wanted to create a short video. Today is day number 15 of the ClickFunnels Funnel Builder Challenge. And uh, the last two days, Saturday, Sunday, were really off days. And really the task for the day was to review all the five steps that we talked about last week and make sure that everything is in plan. And basically that was uh, your offer, creating your offer, sequencing your offer. So now that we have the offer in place and we're starting to build out our products, now we're gonna talk about this week how to publish information so that we can start developing relationships with the people that want to learn the information from us so we can actually create our audience, create our raving fans, create our tribe. So how do we do that? How, what are the platforms that we use? So there's basically three different ways that people consume information. That's either by uh, reading something, by watching a video or listening to uh, some sort of podcast, that sort of thing. So here's a couple of resources that uh, Russell Brunson gave us, which was for writing. If, you're, if you like writing, if you're good at writing, and you want to communicate with your audience by, via writing and text, and if, uh, you want to put that on a blog, the place to go is medium.com. That's medium.com, and that's a place where you can go. Now, you, why can't you just post it on your own blog? You can. But then, Google's got to find the information, it's got to get ranked, and that can take forever. Medium.com has tens of millions of people that already go there for other people to publish content. So it's just a quicker and easier way to get your information in front of more eyeballs. Second thing is video. Uh, of course, most people learn via video, and video is very easy if you like getting in front of cameras like I do, where you can just get in front of a camera, explain what you got, what you want, and what how they can benefit. So the way that we do that, I personally like to use YouTube, um, but then also um, you can actually use Facebook Live or you can use uh, Instagram uh, and Instagram Live. Both, all three really have uh, pluses and minuses. I prefer YouTube. Um, I have started doing more uh, Facebook Live stuff um, and really just started getting into doing uh, Instagram Live. And then, of course, lastly is audio, doing podcasts. I also started doing podcasts about a month ago. just did my third one this morning, which was awesome, with an elite Bass Pro Fisherman. That's for anybody that knows fishing. Uh, you'll know that's like the NFL guys of the fishing industry. A uh, guy I uh, interviewed this morning has earned over $1.9 million uh, in winnings uh, in fishing prizes and tournaments. So that was a really great uh, uh, broadcast, and that's a lot of really good information for our, for our, our readers um, and our listeners uh, in our podcast. So uh, a real uh, great uh, place to go to use a, a, a simple app uh, that leads to a website that will actually make promoting your podcast very simple and very easy to pu push it out to a lot of different platforms is anchor.fm. So that's anchor.fm. So basically what we got is we've got three different resources for writing, video, and of course audio, that's medium.com for writing, that's Facebook, uh, Instagram, or YouTube for video, and of course anchor.fm for podcasts. So hopefully that was helpful. We'll see you tomorrow.